Hi, I'm Monica Pearson here with Rhonda Duffy of Duffy Realty of Atlanta, the number one agent in the U.S. three years in a row and in Georgia 11 years. That's pretty good. You know, I'm never going to be number two. Never. No. Never. Always number one. And you help with the expert edge to let people know the best way to get the best house for them. And one of the things I learned in working with you is to talk to the neighbors. Right, well let's first establish 86% of buyers have buyer's remorse within three months of buying their property. Maybe they find out that the HOA is difficult to get along with. Maybe they find out they've got a sex offender living across the street or next door. Maybe they find out that there's felons that live in the neighborhood. Maybe they find out that the neighborhood is a high rental cap, right? Most renters uh, are capped out. Most, most buildings, by the way, and neighborhoods are capped out at their rentals, okay? Maybe they find out that their financing wasn't the very best it could be. Maybe they find out that the inspector that they hired didn't have insurance, caused damage, and now they're gonna pay for it because they didn't have general contractor's insurance, or maybe the inspector didn't warranty their work. So the inspector didn't find things that were on the inspection that they could have had the seller. Okay, so who knows about all of this stuff? The neighbors. Right? And the neighbors have been around for how long? For however long we've been living places, right? We've all had neighbors. So there's seven key questions. You need to ask three sets of neighbors and you need to be consistent when you're asking the neighbors the questions so that you can get a consistent consensus that you can decide whether it's good for you or not. What are the questions? Well, is there crime in the neighborhood? Why do you think the seller is moving? Have you ever seen any repair trucks at the seller's property? Right? Most people know about basements that flood because it's a neighborhood uh, you know, scenario where lots of basements floods. You want to know are there any assessments coming up in the building? Right? Because you certainly don't want to own a building, a, a unit, and then all of a sudden figure out, oh, there's an $18,000 assessment, right? Because they need to replace the stucco on the outside of the building. Um, all of those things are things that we share with our clients. So when you become a client at Duffy Realty, we will give you that list of questions, not only for your homework, in case you see somebody out walking the dog in a neighborhood that you're interested in, but it is a rhythm and a process that we take our buyers through every single time. Very important. It is important. When I bought the condo through Duffy Realty of Atlanta, I was there asking questions at each place I went. And I learned early on that the HOA would be a pain in the tuchus. Right. And that helped me decide whether or not I wanted to buy there. Right. And it's okay if they are, as long as you know as beforehand. As long as you know in advance. That's right. See, you all just have that competitive edge. That's right. That's why we're the experts. <laughs> <laughs> Tuffy Realty of Atlanta.